Tyler. How you doing, first of all? Doing well. You're looking good. Yeah. Huh? yeah. Feeling good? Feel great. Hey, yeah. Yeah. Well, let's talk about it. How has it been going thus far? And it's been going good. You know, we have a pretty decent season. You know, we're trying to make a playoff push. And uh, you know, guys just coming to work hard and, you know, just trying to win, you know, by any means necessary. You know, just trying to fight every game like this is last. And every game at this point matters. Like, the season, so right. You're looking pretty good. You guys look like you got some momentum going, and yeah. I guess you're pursuing Atlanta. Yes, it looks yes. like it's so, gonna be so interesting. It, it going could be down very down interesting. Right so Atlanta has lost two games already, and uh, you know we still continue trying to push these. You know this this stretch. Uh, this is a big road trip for us. So. Yeah. What have you learned thus far, you know, transitioning the team to team? What have you learned and what do you like in New York? Big city, big 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 town. Big, it's it's big, big, you know, it's a lot of things, it's a lot of distractions, it's a lot of temptation, but I think um, And how do you stay focused? Just 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 knowing how it feels to be a Nick. You know, mm. it's it's a little different than them, you know, than being anything else to me. You know, being a Nick and like being playing in Madison Square Garden and being such a big city where everybody know you. It just like it gives you that edge where it's like, you know, all that could be great if you handle your business. And right. I think it's more of like a business first, and that's what everything you do in New York. I learned like no matter what you do, it's garbage, man. Anything, it's, you put your job first and you do it. And, and I think that's the mentality that I have going into it. Sure. And uh, it's been working so. So it sounds like you've matured, you've grown up a lot. Yeah. Accelerated, huh? Oh, yeah. I mean, that's a yeah. big Definitely lifestyle. Got, huh? got you, yeah. yeah. You can't be no little kid in that. No. It, it'll eat you up. Right, right. And let's talk about as far as you know, the future in New York. And, you know, and you got Phil Jackson there. Mm -hmm. You got a lot of things happening. You know, he's definitely going to change the culture, you know, bring a, you know, his positivity, uh, his knowledge. Um, the things that he's done in his career, you know, we all feed off on, mm -hmm. and it's already started, I, I believe. And um, you know, I think I think guys, you know, that see him around and, and like you know know that he's with us on board. It's like it's, you know, it's, you know, such a great feeling. And um, you know, guys just want to play hard for him and, right. and, and play hard for each other, and uh, you know, just kind of keep the momentum going. And what's the expectations tonight? You're in L.A. Big game. Uh, you know, I always expect the unexpected. You know, I just go out and play my best. All know, right. Cheer on my team and do whatever it takes to win. All right. What's your philosophy? Any, any words of inspiration that you live by? Um, uh, control your mind and control you. All right. Uh, Very good. Control the outcome and just always do your best. Fantastic. Good success to you. Yeah.